thing. I just got out of work. I'm so sorry. I do not want to present myself like this. Let me get into some better light. Hold up. Because I don't know how you is. Okay. Hey, Kendra. Hey, baby. I can't see your face. You watch your body on the whole time? It's up to you. Can you hear me? I can't see your face. Uh, so bring the camera. Can you see my face now? I can see your face now. Okay. You want to keep your body on? Oh, yes, girl. I'll get my hair done Saturday. Okay. What's your name? My name is Shanquita Payton. What? Shanquita? Yes. And what, where you call me from, love? Um, I'm Jackson, Mississippi. Jackson, Mississippi. Do you have any kids? Yes, ma'am. I have one, a three year old. Right now, with the dad. Before she say that, all right, y'all know I'm not about to let this slide. Her name is what? Bum, 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 bum. She said, like, Shaquita? Yeah. Sha the other Sha sister had a wild name before her. This is like back to back, like Shaquita. And... Yeah. Shaquita, Tanquisha, Bonquisha. Gun, Gun Tiana. Come on with it. And that ain't no nip, so here we go. That's on y'all. That's damn true. Plan. If y'all don't stop, and, and and these are the parents of our generation. Y'all, y'all about you go. 45 years old and younger. This is a new age of ignorance. Y'all need to there stop. You go. I listen here, like Gav said, we grew up with this man is gro growing up with it. I was hell bent. I named I try to name all my kids single syllables. <laughs> I'm over it. Uh uh. Nope. Oh. Over it. Yeah, we come up during right. the age where uh y'all was trying to name y'all kids after cars like Lexus and Mercedes and after mm -hmm. alcohol like Alize and Hennessy. Y'all and now we're getting into this these three syllable, you know, nook keys. And the apostrophes. Words. They yeah, come on. Our melanated sisters love throwing an apostrophe somewhere in the name. They're gonna throw an apostrophe in that mamma jamma. I know somebody, I know uh somebody, I know a couple of sisters. They got between four or five kids each, and all eight kids they ain't got apostrophes in them. All of them. You know what I'm saying? Just stay with us. Just uh, come on. Y'all know this ain't right. Y'all putting all this pressure on school teachers and you know, people people at the uh the driver license center, you know, all these people don't deserve this unnecessary stress when it comes to pronouncing a Negro's name. All right. Yeah. And you know what? Come on. If we think it's funny, you don't think some little, you know, some little Polish granny at the driver license center don't she said you gotta figure out how to spell uh rumple rumple steel bone quisha. Uh -huh. And you sitting there with an attitude. Cause she don't know that the Q be silent and she, come on, man. <laughs> Real talk. Here we go, man. No. Why not? Uh, it's, we was together for like four years and we had broke up. Why? Uh, like, you know how you outgrow somebody when you do it? He was all I knew. So, and <laughs> so why would you put the way? Anyway, I ain't got time for the comments. But yeah, he was all that I knew, and I just outgrew him, so I just left. Okay, what, what? do you do for a living? I'm a line operator at a chicken plant, and I'm in school. How old are you, baby? I'm 23. I'm young. 23? Yeah. You said you're going to, what are you going to school for? I'm going to school for business administration. Okay. Um, what's your zodiac sign? Sagittarius. And, all right, so this is? Shaquita? Shanquita. Shanquita. What? Turn around so the light can be in your face. Uh, That's better. Okay, this is good. Okay. You have very pretty skin. Thank you. Shanquita, Jackson, Mississippi. She has a three year old as a line operator, 23 year old Sagittarius. You're so close to the phone. You got to push yourself back. What kind of man are you looking for? Um, Let's see. Someone who's genuine, that's real, um, has a job um really like got a lot going for himself really just not like not with the new generation how everybody want a sneaky link i want somebody this on my level what okay somebody on our level what's your deal breakers zero breaker doesn't have their own place um lie too much doesn't listen lack communication um not there's not honest I don't, I don't tolerate stuff like that. You don't tolerate 
or stuff like no. that. Okay. Um, does he have to be in Jackson, Mississippi? Um, um no, because I. Tr well, here we go, man. Shout out to my guy, football junkie. This sister, and, and we had uh Philly Banks up here since she worked on the chicken on the line. This this young lady here is down somewhere in Mississippi working in a plant on the line at a damn chicken plant. Y'all know what kind of work. I mean, everybody got to get to the bag how you got to get to the bag. But, man, this is a lot for this young single mom. Well, Come on, man. There you, there you go. Yeah, how how does somebody working in the chicken, fa chicken factory outgrow the any daggone thing? That, that's our point. She ever tell me she didn't outgrow somebody? You up here on Kendra's show on Beyonce's internet with this with this bonnet on, working at the chicken factory out here. You out here plucking feathers from a chicken's ass, but you outgrow somebody. Come on now, come on man, do better. Shout out to Theo Goo. Man, here we go. Well, look next time. Use your eyes. They ain't supposed to just be hazel. They are supposed to do some goddamn work around here. All right. That's what the uh, guy in the chicken plant be saying. Holy hell. <laughs> Travel a lot, so I don't stay in one place. So he don't have to be in Jackson. Okay. Does he have to look a certain way? Um, I mean, I got a type, but at the same time, yeah, because I don't like light skins, but yeah, it's all right, or, you know. You don't like, you don't like light skin. I know, right? It never works out with him. That's what I'm saying. I'm not trying to throw any type of shade or anything. It just never works out when I meet a light-skinned dude. It never works out. Never works out. Okay. Mm -hmm. So no light-skinned men. Um, could he have kids? Um, yeah, he can have kids. Long, yeah. yeah. Okay. So um, what's the age range you would date? Um, let's see. My age range, probably about 24 to, say, 27. 24 to 27. Yeah. Let's do the kids you can. Oh, girl. Hold up. Girl, I ain't got no clothes on. Uh huh. We gotta start taking a poll. Does this kid I ain't got no clothes on. And I'm skinny. I ain't got no clothes on. Wait, go, put some pants on. We gotta see your legs. Shorts on. I got shorts on. Okay, we gotta see your legs. Okay. What kind of, you got shorts on? Like, Booty yeah, I'm gonna, go I'm gonna go downstairs. Hold on a second. You gonna do what? I'm gonna go downstairs so you can see my full body. Oh, good sure. Okay. Can I see? Okay. Okay, you look small. Yeah. <laughs> so this is, say it again, Sean Quetta. Sean Quetta. Sean Quetta. Uh, what? You want somebody to remember that name? She got a Kendra Key, John Quetta, Kuda Kata. Huh? What the hell's your name? Sean Quisha, Sean Kusha. You got a got an apostrophe in there, a hyphen, a damn exclamation mark in midway through that. Some of the, what we what we doing? So yeah, this is a young sister here. Uh, where we at? I mean, the band is imminent, I would imagine. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she up here, she's slow. So she don't even get a full band. She definitely a half tap shorty, you know, nug nug on his way. It's over. She's, she burnt out. She burnt out at a tender age, a 20 tree. We'll give her a last word while the band getting set up. Here we go. Queen, I'm, I'm so sad. I blame my mother. You blame <laughs> your mother. Sean Quita. Let me see something. Sean you said, Quita, your mama. Jackson, Mississippi, three-year-old. When was your last relationship? Um, with my child's father. Okay. You're so close to the phone, baby girl. We have to be able to see your face. Right here. Okay. Is it good enough? Yes. Yeah. You don't okay. have to answer, but I'm going to ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? I do not work fine. Okay. What are three what? flaws you think you have to work on? You said what? Three flaws you have to work on. Um, my three flaws. Um, let's see. Being less aggressive. I'm very passive aggressive. Some people say that. Um, um, being less straightforward. Like some sometimes I come on too strong to certain men. I don't know. They said, "Where's the rest of the blinds?" I just moved into this apartment and they gotta replace the blinds. I hate when people comment on something you don't know nothing about. 
<laughs> Get it right, baby. I do not stay in the hood. I have my own everything. With your grandmother or your mom? What? Can go back to what we were talking about. That's not big flowers. <laughs> okay. Okay. Try to, try to stay steady, honey. Um, okay. Why? What's the age range you would date? Um, I told you. Um, my age, twenty three to twenty seven. Do you want more kids? Um, yeah, that's fine. Longest, yeah. like, just two. Like, I can have another one. Can the guy have kids? Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Why would a guy be lucky to be with you? Because I'm like, I'm myself. Like, I be myself anywhere I go. Even though I got my bunny on, like, if I didn't even have my bunny on, I still, you know. Like, I'm optimistic. I'm very adventurous. I'm very outgoing with myself. I just, I just be myself and I'm real. Like, a guy should be lucky to be with me. But at the same time, everybody does come with flaws and everybody is you know, imperfection, like I'm very imperfected. And what? I still got a lot of stuff to work on and I'm learning because I'm young. So I'm looking for something serious, but at the same time, you know, work with me. But I'm not, you know, how they be like, well, I'm messed up. I got some, I'm not like that. I'm in my healing process. Okay, she's in our healing process. Let's do it. And you said, you know, he doesn't have to be in Mississippi. If the, the guy that's interested is this, wait, say your name, because I don't want to say it wrong again. <laughs> Just call me Denise. That's my middle name, Denise. Denise. <laughs> Holy hell. Why ain't you start the interview off like we done we done we done what? ran you through the mud. And, and and she ended all by saying, you know what? Just call me Denise. Holy hell. What? What in the world? So, so listen, you just abandon the the Sharkisha name you got. Just go with Denise if that works somehow. Somehow you got Denise under that? We fine. I ain't no rules anyway. Go go with it. Go with it. She says her That's middle it. name. Her middle. Yeah, you need to just go by your middle name, sister. Yeah. Recommend it. You heard it here first. Scrap that. Uh, mm. I'm sorry, going by my middle name. <laughs> so here we go, people. This woman, she come on with the bonnet. And here we go. I got to get my PSA as I always do. Don't do it, man. I'm trying to learn how to golf. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. All right. That's my nightly PSA. Don't be afraid to divest. I'm just saying. If this is if this is what you got it, I mean, come on. Come on. Not this. Yeah, yeah not this at all. Not this. Whole little tink tink. So here we go. Shout out to my guy Eric Jordan. He says, sis, only qualify for the stroke and nothing else. At that, like I said, there you you catch her cam like that, but she a little, you know, she like a crack fit or whatever. So mm. just keep chopping and chopping up them chicken feet and keep outgrowing, folks. Go um, ahead. That'd be about it, sister. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna throw her in the junior band. I see some of y'all said the junior band was blowing y'all eardrums out. We're gonna have to. We'll fix it after the show, but for now, here we go. <laughs> Got <to> eat that. <laughs> so yeah, man, she came on that bonnet, post sister twenty three, whole whole neck tattoo. Come on, that's that's just that's toxic, toxic hunching. Toxic hunting. What's what's the uh, hook consensus? Those toxic mercenaries got the best kudakana. Great like that. So here we go. 